right, welcome back. It's your boy Domizetti. As you can see, I've got a few neck tats and a lot less job opportunities. As a way of showing you how committed I am to YouTube. I did this for you guys, don't ever forget that. And don't forget to go to DonMerch.com and show me how thankful you are with your money. Halloween is the uber pool you just called for the chick who doesn't give head cause it's right around the corner and just like her, you don't wanna blow it. This is your one night a year to be somebody other than yourself. This is your one chance to get noticed for something besides staring too long at the chick who's squatting in leggings made of tracing paper. Yeah, I wanna trace out with my tongue. Ah, ah. Uh, uh. I just spelled my name. I think I spelled it wrong. D, oh, is it two O's? Like boob? Doob? I don't know, either way, gonna eat ass. Halloween is the purge for douchebags. Every other night of the year, society hates you, but not today. Not today. Today is Jacked History Month. They only gave us a day. Everybody else gets a whole month, all right? Not fair. Women. You get one night, eight hours maybe, okay? So here's some costume ideas for gym bros. Okay, first costume. So you've been dirty bulking since 2014 when you discovered if it fits your macros and became addicted to Pop-Tarts and sour candy. And then you tried to cut in 2020 by going keto, which just turned into you eating burger patties as bread and putting butter on your cheese. And since shockingly, having 6,000 calories of fat and zero self-discipline actually made you fatter, you decided now you're just a power lifter. If this sounds familiar, then I got the perfect costume for you. He's big, he's green, he's angry, and nobody likes him. That's right, you guessed it, Shrek. Just like you, Shrek has a good sense of humor about how fat and ugly he is. And you can use this to try to find a chick who is out of your league and looking to punch down and let herself go so she can stop putting effort into being hot before the ravages of time give her no choice. And as a power lifter, you can finally pull something that will impress people. All right, next up, Baki. Bak Baki. I, I, I'll be honest, I don't know if I'm saying that right because I don't watch anime because I'm not fucking weird. Now I know I'm gonna catch a lot of heat for this from the anime stands, but anime dudes are just Disney adults whose parents didn't love them. With that said though, on the surface, this is a great Halloween costume for gym bros trying to show off the gains. All you need is some red boxes, some tape on your wrists and ankles, and the songs you've been blasting to finally kick in. The problem is, no chick is gonna know what your costume is, and when she asks, you're not only gonna have to explain what you are, but why it isn't weird that a grown man watches cartoon fight porn. Throwing around words like manga, yeah, manga make a pussy dry up. Then she'll make fun of you to her friends, and you'll use this as motivation for your villain arc, which is just snap stories of you lifting in a hoodie and reposting Andrew Tate clips, calling women whores, while simultaneously explaining why it's their fault for not wanting to bang you. Which, let's be honest, kinda sounds like bulletproof logic to me. But, if you're looking for a more obvious costume, just go as an incel instead. Okay, super trendy one here. Jeffrey Dahmer. Now this one, not gonna lie, pretty problematic for obvious reasons. Now maybe you think people take things too seriously nowadays, and you're like, relax, it's just a Halloween costume. But how out of touch are you if you think this is a good idea? I mean, seriously, explain to me how. How are you gonna show off your gains wearing a jumpsuit? Sweeves? Sweeves? On Halloween? This sickens me. How can you glorify such a thing? Real people were hurt. Real people. Me. Me and my fucking eyes. Now, if you're gonna hack something up, hack the sleeves off that jumpsuit, get a killer pump, and go as Buffery Dahmer the Milwaukee cannabolic. Now if people are gonna be offended by your costume, it's gonna be because of your monstrous biceps and your blood-soaked veins. It's edgy, it's trendy, and if you're lucky, you might just go viral on TikTok and get canceled. So you don't have to show up to work. That's how it works, right? Like if you get canceled, like you, no. you don't have to show up to work. No. That's how it works. If you get canceled, you don't have to show up to work, you don't have to pay your bills, it's like a snow day. Getting canceled is like a snow day for life. And now a word from our sponsor. Question, are you a douche lord but dream of becoming an actual lord? Do you wanna own something other than clip art of a monkey and the responsibility of wiping out your parents' retirement fund? Well, with established titles, you can do both. 
With these title packs, you can purchase at least one square foot of dedicated land in Scotland with a unique plot number. Thereby making you a lord or a lady, just like me. Lord No Quad, Skipper of Leg Day, aka your lord and savior of planet Earth. That's right, with each order, a tree will be planted. With Global Charities, one tree planted and trees for the future to support global reforestation efforts. So you will literally be saving the world and yourself from having to die alone because you can now officially include the title Lord or Lady on your credit cards, your plane tickets, or your dating apps. The first 200 people to purchase a title pack with my link will be next to my plot so we can build our own kingdom. It makes an amazing last minute gift. Established Titles is actually running a massive sale right now. Plus, if you use the code BRO, you'll get an additional 10% off. Go to establishedtitles.com slash bro to get your gifts now and help support the channel. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. I look like Dog the Bounty Hunter. Not what I was going for, okay? This is obviously Ken from Barbie and Ken. Oh, I bet we'll have flying cars in the future. Yeah, I'll raise you one, peasant from the past. Live action, body positive Barbie and Ken movie that nobody asked for. Now for this costume, you're gonna need two things. A girlfriend and your genitals to be removed. Which already rules out 90% of you involuntary sweller bits watching this. But rules back in the same 90% who have abused so much gear that dickly speaking, they're already a live action Ken doll. Now aside from having to be neutered twice, once from the consequences of your own actions, and again by your girlfriend making you wear this couple's costume, this is actually a pretty solid costume for dudes to show off the gains. I mean, a cut off denim vest, which let's be honest, you've been looking for the courage to wear since the day you became obsessed with male muscles. It shows off all your gains in a way that says high school bully that'll beat you up in front of his friends and beat you off behind the bleachers. And as a bonus, you can wear it open to show off your abs and close it up when you get bloated from drinking too many hard kombuchas. And in the spirit of coming out, you finally have an excuse to dye your hair blonde since you didn't have the balls to do it in 2017 when it was trendy. And now when people ask why you dyed your hair, you don't have to say because you wanted to try something new and change up your look. You can just say it was for Halloween and spare yourself the judgment of trying to be yourself. Shit. <laughs> Don't be with it. <laughs> Save that for later. Boxer. Half y'all pretending to be boxers anyway. What's one more day? And now you have an easy way to work into every conversation how you've been boxing. And yeah, sure, no one needs to know you train at Rumble Boxing because it's the closest you'll come to getting boxed from an Instagram model. And the last time you fought was for your life in the comments of a thirst trap TikTok. Just throw on some shorts that hide as much leg as possible or show way too much of it, making people question how the tip of your clit doesn't poke out the bottom of them. Hike them up to cover your permabulk fupa. Toss on some gloves to hide your dainty wrists. These are MMA gloves since clearly I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Some high top shoes to hide whatever the opposite of cankles are. And boom, you're ready to fight a washed up internet celebrity for charity. The charity being you and the donation being clout. A Greek god. Now since wearing a 300 Spartan costume is now the Halloween equivalent of wearing a fedora, you can try dressing up as a Greek god. Which is fitting since you used to be a god at your frat, but college is over now and nobody worships you or believes in you anymore. Including yourself. This is also a great costume if you're too broke or lazy to get a real costume. All you need is a bed sheet to tie like a toga and boom! Looking like Juice got a lightweight. One glaring issue here though that splinters into many other glaring issues is you haven't washed your bed sheets since college. Now you're gonna be wearing a toga covered in hot Cheeto stains that you say is a chick's makeup, your drunk piss stains that you say is squirt, and ketchup stains that you say is period blood. Add the stains to the fact that this toga looks like a flirty little dress and you're gonna end up looking like a female bodybuilder who went clubbing after the show and got trashed because she ruined the hormones for 11th place. 
Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. New videos. Every winner is coming. So make sure to keep yourself warm at DonMerch.com with amazing gear like Ah oh, Pump Focus. Basically muscle meth or heart attack booty flavored. Or shop our sports memorabilia collection. Sets jerseys, lifters, swoles. Question, you on juice? I got the hat for your Lego head. Mass bro shops. Coming in three different colors, that's right. You like playing games? I know my bitch does. So grab her or yourself the Do You Even Lift game. And when that spirals into another fucking argument, settle yourself down with the Bro Science Flask set. Reps for Jesus, shots for Satan. While supplies last. That's what they say in commercials. I've been taking an acting class because my bitch been acting up. <clears throat>